businesses that can act on their data fastest. They are going to benefit the most in this age of insight. I'm Ronald van Loon, an HP partner, and I had the opportunity to view HP Discover and learn about the incredible new advancements in the edge to cloud world from HP CEO Antonio Neri and from GM President and CEO Mary Berra and from FIS Chief Data Officer Robert Lechters. No matter what industry, the future is edge to cloud. And organizations need to build an edge to cloud architecture to drive these new innovative opportunities at the core level and build and manage new customer strategies, but also create a more secure infrastructure. So let's take a look at what the edge to cloud future looks like. Last year, I said we are entering the age of insight, driven by the next wave of digital transformation, empowered by the massive amount of data we connect, collect, and analyze. Most of it created and acted upon at the edge. However, it is no longer about simply capturing data. It is about how fast we can extract value from it. Real-time data accessibility is key to navigating digital transformation today and also post-pandemic and thriving in this digital economy. So organizations they need the flexibility and safer real-time data accessibility of an edge-to-cloud architecture that enables from business critical analytics, but also responsiveness to real-time changes in risk in rapid viable decision-making and the means to derive insights from your data before it's outdated. And the automotive industry is greatly benefiting from data value generation. So some automotive businesses, they're even leveraging real-time data to shift from traditional hardware companies to a subscription as a service opportunity. So for example, data from connected cars is driving subscriptions for premium connectivity services and upgrades like usage-based insurance. So let's learn more about how the past year has accelerated transformation and what the impact has been in the automotive industry. We've been working on our culture to make sure that we provide an inclusive culture, one where everyone feels that they belong, everyone can speak up, everyone can do their best work, which really will allow us to excel. We also have been shifting skill sets as a natural transition in our company to those with more of a software background to really enable what's happening with the vehicle. Yes, it's, it's hardware, but it is software. And there's so much opportunity from a software perspective to really delight and surprise the customer. Edge to Cloud is a strong ally in serving today's always on-demand organization, employee and the customer culture needs. So mitigating departmental silos, encouraging and cross-process collaboration and empowering employees with new experiences and the tools to resolve challenges themselves are just a few ways that the cloud is helping organizations to build a resilient and more adaptive culture fueled by this agile new way of working. But it also ensures organizations can quickly improve performance and drive business outcomes and also fast track innovation. So, end customers, they are benefiting. As organizations embrace these new ways of thinking alongside the cloud enabled strategies that help them to leverage the data to respond to this shifting customer behaviors. So let's discover more now. One thing we know about consumers is every pattern change. Absolutely every trend, every analysis, Every one of the patterns they did in their personal lives changed and how those go back into what we'll call the new norm or how they transition into what the future holds is going to be something we're going to have to monitor in real time. And so our goal is to make sure that, again, you create that kind of real time access and use of data so that you can adjust as the market adjusts. Architectures built around zero trust, they are accelerating this. Employees continue to work remotely but also new technological adoption increases momentum. And there is a compounding need for efficient security as corresponding risk escalates. So organizations who implement a zero trust approach to security, they will be better prepared to detect security breaches in record time. So breaches that might have taken a month to detect are recognized now in seconds. And simultaneously, Zero trust prevents cybersecurity from becoming a barrier to digital transformation 
which can happen when organizations slow new technological deployments due to this security risk concerns. So a zero trust approach to security also creates new levels of control and monitoring capabilities to mitigate disruption that impact privacy and that can impact your data. So there's more on zero trust security. Every entity on an enterprise network, whether it's a person, software runtime, like a container or VM, or systems like servers, storage arrays, and networking switches, must have a provable or a testable identity that is continuously verified before the entity can transact on the network. So Edge to Cloud is, is the future in building real-time data capabilities that drive progress and drive innovation and meeting the always on demand of a modern customer and modern businesses and an employee culture. So in combination with implementing a zero trust approach to security and to risk, organizations can create a lasting architectural foundation that is resilient and it's adaptive to the disruption and to this changing market behaviors. Thank you for listening. I'm Ronald van Loon and this is the intelligent world.